This is the Resulta E7. It was made in Berlin at the Maschinen und Werkzeugfabrik Paul Brüning. And uh, the first version was called the Minerva and was ma made in 1927. This one is from the 60s. Uh, it's the final generation of this machine. Addition is uh, very easy to do. You see these slots and with a stylus, I don't have the original one, you just uh, enter the numbers The number you entered becomes visible in the input register here at the bottom and as you enter it, it's added to the output register at the top. You can press this bar to clear the input and then you can add another number. It gets added to the top immediately. As you can see, there's automatic carry the input register doesn't have a carry mechanism because it's not necessary, it's only for display. To clear the register, you pull this lever here. And uh, this small lever at the front, that's used during multiplication. It's uh, if you move this down, it pushes down on this uh, input clearing bar. So now when you input a number, the input immediately uh, returns to normal. That allows you to uh, enter a number several times in quick succession. So now I've done 3 times 6. And if I do this, one, two, three, four, five, six. This is then six times forty-three. The uh, the lever on the left here, that's for subtraction. If you move this up, it's the register uh, switches let me just move it back slowly. As you can see, the numbers move up. That's because the uh, register is disconnected from these input wheels. And in the meantime, a different set of gears drops down, so that now the register is connected to the input through a set of intermediate gears. And this shutter uh, moves as well, so that you can still see just the numbers that you're interested in. And if I now enter a number, 55, you can see it gets subtracted immediately. And of course the carry still happens. There you go. Unfortunately the clearing lever doesn't work in subtraction mode because the wheels would have to turn the, the wrong way. So yeah, to clear it, you first have to go back to sub to addition mode, and then you can clear it with the handle. On the bottom here, um, if you look very closely, you can just about see a number scratched in there. That's the month and year that this one was made. During the final inspection, the quality control officer probably scratched in this number. So 763 means July 1963. So there you go. This was the Resulta E7.